time. No idea. He just wanted to be closer. Uh -huh. No idea when he found his thousand cash, so I'll let him in later. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> His first cash was Beaver Creek in Amherst. <laughs> His other cash was Beaver's blue hair and a trout. <laughs> oh, Charlie! <laughs> so with, with that being said, Charlie's been cash for seven years. Um, I've had the opportunity to cash with him a little bit, and the incident that really got me to know Charlie was Wadsworth, Wooster, yeah. <laughs> so we go down there, and if any of you have ever cashed with me, you know I don't really have a lot of patience of direction yeah. or how to read my GPS. So I get us to the first parking lot and waited 15 minutes for Susie and Charlie to show up until later find out they stopped for ice cream on the way there. <laughs> and Not me. Magnet pulls out his computer thing and pulls up and realizes this is not a cash, this is a nine part multi. It's going to take us all day. Charlie, just being the trooper, let's do it. <laughs> so we ran around the whole town of Wooster for about, what, five hours to find one cash. <laughs> and throughout that day, I really got to know Charlie and, and realized that he is a lot of fun to cash for. So with that, I made him his can, going with the beach theme. <laughs> got his name on there and some beach stuff on both sides. And then, of course, a lot of uh, hiking and and then on the front, two important things, Paradise Mountain, right. which is uh -huh. what a lot of times I feel like when we find a cache, and I'm sure most geocachers feel that way, and a okay. camera, because every time I see Charlie when he's not caching, it's because he has a camera and he's taking pictures of kids. Yeah. And I got you a picture with the rock with your name on it. Thought that would look really nice. Mm -hmm. And no offense intended, but sometimes when you're cashing with certain people, you might need these in the car. Air pressures. <laughs> I wonder who she means, Paul. <laughs> Not me. I also got you some basic cashing needs, a first aid kit, a splinter removal kit. Couple of uh, flashlights. Oh, get to the good stuff. If you're in a winter cache, <laughs> you might need to de ice your locks, and you can also use this when you've got something frozen. Get it out of there and get I've done that. Warm your hands up. You can also use this to warm something up that's frozen to the ground and try to get it unstuck. Experience that. Shame on you, Charlie. Phone a friend. Here you go. Before you leave, get everybody's number. If you can't find that cache, you can phone a friend. Some people don't use it. Yeah. Pray for daylight. You can use this at pray for daylight. North is that way. <laughs> ah. New Philly, old Philly. <laughs> Avoid the north <laughs> slope. <laughs> Yeah. Funny. And from Geo Sarge, you're one thousand point for me and I made you a scrapbook. Aww. I did not do the journaling because I thought you might be able to do it. That's nice. That's different.